Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to show you how to copy a video and put it down. Let's begin. Copying a video and placing it down in CapCut is a useful feature, especially if you want to duplicate a video, segment it to use it multiple times within your project, whether it's for repeating scenes, transitions, or adding different effects. So, first off is open the CapCut app on your mobile device and hover to the project that you are working. If you don't have any project, just click on the new project to begin your work, but in my case, I have already a project in place so i'm gonna click on it to begin editing you see i'm gonna add a video right here see this uh plus button if i click the add button what will happen is i'm going to add this video but the thing is as you can see it wasn't placed down it's just part of the one timeline so i'm going to add more video along the way so if you click the video and click the copy right here, there should be the copy option at the bottom part of your screen. So if you don't have the copy, the duplicate should be um, okay. So let's click the duplicate. All right. The thing is you can't put it down, right? You see, if you select the video, if you try to move your fingers, you can't do it. It's it's Your option is kind of limited if you're using the mobile device. It's easier in the... Uh, CapCut online version and the CapCut app for PC. So for you to be able to move it down, what I'm going to do is delete this for now. And I'm going to click the overlay section at the bottom. Because what I'm going to do is to create a new layer for that second video. And as you can see, I have pasted the video down here in CapCut. All right. It's kind of easy, really. Now you have now two videos in place. All right. You can decrease the other video right here on the top to kind of make kind of create like a miniature of that put it on the uh, top corner and try to see play it from the beginning to see what we got from here of course copying the video and placing it behind other elements like maybe if you want to add text stickers or overlays you can create a death or add a dynamic background to the project which is kind of really easy all right and then once you're happy with the effects transitions and all that just click the expert button on the top right corner of your screen. What will happen is it would be forwarded here. And then save it to file for different file formats. And maybe if you want to send it to your client, create a copy, export that, and send it to your team members. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next video.